Uh, you know this, you know this UPC, all of this is because we are in the campus. So it's light. Do you know these places? More, more of you, you know these places. So what is the challenge about? Well, we want to trace track contents of a COVID-19 positive person on campus. But where? Where? In all the campus, in the stairs, in the bar, in the restaurant, at classroom, and the exam, you know, the exam, okay? And everywhere. So what can we do? So it's light. Okay, first of all, we should know what is a close contact. I should have said that before, but anyway. Uh, in order to be a close contact, it depends on the week you know, the, you, you can listen the news, okay? But let's say that the, the close contact for us is time, distance, two, two hours, meters, okay? So if you are in the middle of, a, I don't know, uh, you have a lot of people around, you stay here two hours, you are speaking, shouting or whatever, and you don't have mass as I, as I show you, uh, and it's past the time or it is close, then you say you are a close contact of these positive people. So what is going on? What we are doing at FIP? Well, we are keeping some information of the classroom, no restaurants, no stairs, anywhere else, not, nothing, only classroom. What we are doing there? Okay, we are doing, having information of chairs, table, room table, you know that. You have been passing, okay, you are here, you are here in the exam. Oh, come on, please, I want to do the exam. Yes, but you are here and there may be errors. So should we look for another thing? Should we look for another method to be, to be more fair? Okay, slide. So yes, sure that you can create something. I'm sure that you will be able to create something in order to, first, maybe yes, for taking care of what is your position in the matrix. You have a, there a classroom position, uh, rows, colon, who is the best way to uh, obtain this information? I'm in the chairs, room, uh, sorry, row one, cl uh, column one. Or maybe should we use something like, uh, I don't know, Bluetooth? Something related with, uh, uh, I don't know, maybe the radar COVID or something better, I don't know. Or maybe something related with the, uh, I don't know, indoor position. This can be also a, a way to do that. I'm looking for the names, uh, I, yes. We can have near field communication. Yes, why not? Some mobiles has this. And also radio frequency. This is something that maybe you can use in order to detect that some people is close by. We are not close to any of this technology. We are not close to take the position if, of the row and the column. We are only asking, can you think in something that can help us to be live, to, to have life, to, to go to the campus? And if somebody happens, okay, we can easily found, find the contact people that was close to you. Maybe it's just a QR. Oh, if you can use this QR for the next challenge I will present. You can use it if you want. Come on. Uh, but also, you can have labels in the, in the table. But if there is a label in the table and the table can move, oh, we have a problem. You can use QR, but if you, the table can move, this is a problem. In the position, Bluetooth, maybe it's a better solution. So, OK, go ahead. Think about that. Think that this can help you. And don't miss the talk tomorrow morning because it is about that. Because if you use this kind of technology, maybe you should think about the data that you pick up. Uh, maybe you don't like that you pick up the data and you know which are everybody. Okay, slide. So this is the end. So please look for something for do tracking, tracing on campus. And you can contact us in Discord with Palamarado.